superstar. That is what you are. That's when I was in love with Maya. You guys remember Maya? Welcome back, guys. Brody Footy Fam, we back in the building. Um, it's going to be kind of a weird video today, too. Not so much weird as in, like, structurally, but there is a, uh air quality uh, thing in my area, and we'll talk about that in a second. But we are back at Smash Burger because we love to smash. Pause. Um, okay. So what we have here is the Double Colorado Burger, which has all the good good in it that you would ever need in a situation. All right, so let's get this going. Let's get these receipts out of here. My my car is a mess, guys. I've been working on it. What have I been working on? You guys know what I've been working on it with. Come on. Come on! If you haven't been part of this channel for a while, you need to go back and uh, look at some of the older videos. Got to catch up. Ooh. Yeah. Look at this. Look at all that good, good. So this is the Double Colorado uh, oh, it's got mayo and lettuce. Okay, so lettuce, tomato. It's got the Anaheim, um, uh, the Anaheim, the grilled Anaheim chilies right there. If you guys can see them. Beep, beep, boop. And then also we have uh, pepper jack cheddar. And this is on a spicy, spicy chipotle bun. Right on top. Make it purdy. Look at that. Look how purdy that is. Pow! I love when uh, places come out with specialty burgers. Also, what we got too is the, we got some papa fritas. These are uh, the smash fries. So this is, I believe that they have garlic, olive oil. They're like tossed in this, this beautiful oil. And also what I like guys is I got a side of their smash sauce, which is kind of their, you know, every place has their own, their own little, uh, little smash sauce. What am I trying to say? Secret sauce. There we go. This air quality advisory. We're all uh, a little couple scruples down down the hatch. All right, fam. There we go. Look at that. Look at this meal. Eating like a king. Look at this. Hey, yeah. Beep it bop. All right, guys. We'll take a couple quick bites. We'll get into it. Also, we're gonna be doing a little unboxing. Got some things uh, coming in for the hiking, prepping, uh, camping. <laughs> It's so funny, when, when you do a lot of research with camping and hiking stuff, you become kind of like a mini prepper. You'd start thinking like, oh my God, what if I run out of water here? Let alone on the trail. All right, here we go. Mm -mm -mm. Get that dip dip ready. By the way, these are good without dip dip. But I always like to cut into it a little bit. Mm. All right, man. Let's shut up. Let's start eating. Beep the bop, beep the boop. How are you guys living over here? Oh, look at the chili. That's the bite right there. The chilies and everything. Uh, look at this beautiful queen, guys. Look at this. Upside down. When I dip, you dip, we dip. Ship it. Oh my god. I'm telling you, these burger spots need to... Oh, by the way, obviously on two patties. You can get this as a single or a double. Obviously, we went double. God, this sauce is just insane in the membrane. Certified Angus. I don't want people thinking we're too fancy. Just beautiful. What was the other place? Um, Buffalo Wild Wings did a, uh, 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 um, a hatch chili that was absolutely phenomenal. Mmm. About to take out Mayweather. Phenomenal. 
the chilies aren't too hot guys they just add flavor there's some chilies some people get nervous some chilies don't have heat on them this is there for this is there for flavor also guys in my quest of becoming old i'm an old timer Something else happened today. I found myself. So, hold on. Let me rephrase this. This freaking. This Chick fil A is just. Oh, I mean, Chick fil A is printing money right now. Um. I'm at that age right now where I'm listening to older hip hop and R&B because that's stuff I grew up on, right? 2000s stuff. But there's a station out in Boston called Hot 90, Hot 96.9 that all they do is play that. So I'm officially that person that's listening to an oldies station. Remember growing up when you're like, no, I want to listen to the new stuff. You're like, why are you listening to this old stuff? I'm officially the old person in that scenario now. You're like, that ain't real hip hop. Let me show you what real hip hop is. <laughs> Remember when the older people used to be, that's not real music. You can't even understand what they're saying. Now, I literally don't understand what these new rappers are talking about. Hmm. A great burger. So, guys, today in Rhode Island, and I'm probably sure all of New England, I got this alert <clears throat> air quality. Usually, I think nothing of it, but it was higher than usual. So on the, on my iPhone, I looked up the weather app and it broke down why, what it is, why it's harmful and how long it's gonna be around. So as I left the house to go get food, I noticed that there was this really weird and you could still see it here, but you won't be able to see it in the camera. There's this really light fog over here. And it's really weird. It's so light that you can almost miss it. But if you stare at a place or you're like, I can't see the image that well. I know I sound crazy, but stick with me. So um, essentially, I go online. It said something about PM 2.5 hazardous. So I said, all right. So I started researching it. Come to find out, it's like one of the most harmful things that you can breathe in. The particles are so tiny. The particles are so tiny that they can get stuck in your lungs and can get into your bloodstream. So I was like, what? And then I go outside. Um, I'm reading this earlier in the day going, all right, I just won't leave the house. And I'm like, oh my God, I got to film. <laughs> I got to film for the fam. Um, and when I, when I got outside, I was like, why the heck is my neighbor burning plastic? So as I'm getting to my car and I'm driving, I got the window down, trying not to use the AC, trying to save a couple pesos. Uh, and then I quickly rolled up my door and put on the AC because I just live in AC. I need to be refrigerated. I'm like a, I'm like a piece of meat. And um, it's, it's everywhere. So I guess part of this is like there's this plas burnt plasticky smell everywhere and I'm, I'm very sad that I was breathing that in <laughs> and uh, can't wait to get back home we're gonna eat this and then we're gonna get back to the house but even in your house I don't I don't think I have I'm not one of those fancy rich people that has one of those uh, uh, air filter uh, filtration systems that filters the air from the outside
so it's gonna get in my house anyways. So that's what's going on here in Rhode Island. We have one of the most dangerous uh, um, air quality alerts ever. So I'm like, great, another underlying uh, issue that I have to deal with when I'm older. I kind of want some to me. I don't know, guys, sometimes I crave ketchup. Is that weird? Talk to me. Am I the weirdo? Yeah, I'm the weirdo. Mmm. Actually, the ketchup complements this really well. All right, let's finish this off, and then we're going to get into... Um, some of the, that, we had to do that. You guys know me, I had to dip it. Mm. Also smash burger. They're not allowed to take tips. So when a place doesn't allow tips, I do with a one, one of my jobs, I used to work at Target when I was younger. And what one of the um, older gentlemen, I helped him out, like bring, I think a tree over to his house. I mean, to his house, to his car. He wanted to tip me. And when you're young, you're like, you want to follow the rules. Like, sir, I'm not allowed to. I'm not allowed to. He looked me in my eye and said, there's a lot of things uh, that you're not allowed to do. And he said, I found this five on the floor. So when you flip the switch, everything is about perspectives. He said, I found this five on the floor. Right in my pocket. Guess who got chips? Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. At school, balling. So the point of that story is, that's exactly what I said to this kid. I was like, you guys, because I put my credit card in, I can not I can never keep track of where you can tip, where you can't. Unless it's a sit-down restaurant, that makes sense. He's like, we're not allowed to. And I said, you know what, there's a lot of things you're not allowed to do in this life. Put a few bucks. I mean, the meal was only like 15 bucks, but I, I put a few bucks. Uh, down, I was like, I found these three dollars. He goes, Thank you so much. Guess what he did? I was like, Deja vu. I was like, That's exactly what I did when I was your age. Good kid. There's a lot of things you're not allowed to do in this world. Whatever. Mm. All right, fam, let's get into this. My car's a disaster right now. All right, one last bite, and then we'll move all this. Also, guys, can we talk about how, how close we are to 5,900? Which means that we're one sneeze away. from 6,000 subbies. We gotta do a live, obviously. Where do you guys wanna do a live at? Hmm. All right, let's get this out of the way. Where are we doing the live at, guys? 6,000 subs? Celebration! Okay. So, first things first. When doing a lot of research, on hiking, Also, probably some of you are like, Loop, you just you just housed a double cheeseburger. How are you gonna be trained? How are you, how are you gonna start training for um, hiking? Guys, join the gym tomorrow. So that'll be a celebration in itself. 
I was going I was going regularly before uh, Covito hit. All right. So this is called Sawyer Squeeze. They have a bunch of different ones. So basically, you put this little guy on your water bottle, unfiltered water. You drink through it. It filters it out. Uh, what they also give you in here is, I believe they give you a couple bags. But what I'm going to end up doing is uh, doing what this girl's doing. Right? Just put it on there. Or having some sort of... Um, some sort of gravity thing where I put unfiltered water in there, filter this straight into a water bottle, and then store it, right? Because you guys saw in one of the past videos I had, I, I bought a pouch that I could put my, my water bottle in there. All right, let's gonna, we're gonna open this up. This is the first time I'm actually opening it, so. Exclusive. Oh my God, that burger is like making me sleepy. Oh man, they got that good thin, tape that is going to go, come off in strips. I also need to... Oh my god! Alright, let's do one of these. They did a good job. What kind of freaking tape is this? This is a... Hey, we know it's a return. <laughs> Alright. Here we go, fam. So it comes with a, uh, this bag that you can carry all the stuff in, obviously. Um, there's a lot about this that I still don't know. So they give you some pouches that you can fill with water, put the squeeze here and then put the, and then aim, aim it towards water. So that's cool that they give you that. But this is the, this is what matters right here is this guy. So I, I'm going to watch a couple YouTube videos on how to utilize this. So I'm really excited about this guy. It comes with this thing. I know this looks weird, but this is so that you put it in here. And the, to clean the filter, you have to I forget what they call it. Not backwash, but back, backflow it. Anyways, that, that takes all the stuff out of, uh, you know, all the stuff that builds up in there. So, and the reason why this one is so popular is because it is wicked. And I'm being Rhode Islander right now by saying wicked. This is super light, guys. It's not as small. They have one called the Mini, but this one has a better flow rate. And one of the complaints that I've read online from other uh, campers and hikers is that the Sawyer Mini, uh, the flow rate is just like painstakingly slow. So they're like, dude, you end up like just wanting to go to bed, waiting for your water to be done. So I'm excited to do that. Once uh, once we actually get going, guys, well, a lot of this stuff that I got to, we're going to talk about it more in depth, but I thought that was really cool. Also, what I said in the beginning of the video too, is that when you're researching hiking and camping stuff, you become like a mini prepper. Not an extreme prepper like that show where they have like two years worth of food stored, which I would actually love to do. I'm actually researching how to get a bucket of like 30 days worth of food um, so that I can store it. <laughs> I know that sounds weird, but it's, it's this thing. Um, what I got as backup is uh, these... Are these the tablets? Did I get the tablets? Yeah, I got the tablets right here. Fill up some water, pop it off, let it do its thing, beepity boop. So that's for uh, backup slash also for home use. And then this is the thing that I was really excited about. I've become like, I'm getting crazy. But look at this thing. I don't know if you guys can see it. Let's move this. So this is, it's a NOAA weather uh, radio, um, but it's AM, FM. It's got the different weather bands. Um, it also has um, shortwave, believe it or not, right? And, um, and there's different ways that you can charge it. So it's either battery powered, right? Which I'm always gonna have uh, a couple of each. I gotta store them somehow, uh, but the cool thing about this is that it also has and this is more this i wouldn't be taking this on a hike this would be more for home use or if uh um or if i'm camping like where if you're camping somewhere for like guys one of the things i've been researching man and this is how this is how my life is right now is that i'm just researching everything i've ever wanted to do and i'm just going like i'm just gonna do them <laughs> Regardless of what happens. Oh, that's kind of cool. Oh, I guess you can charge it too. That's good to know. All right, so that's so cool. Look at that thing. 
Right, let's put this down here for now. So, the cool thing about this, yeah. So you could charge it, and it's also a battery pack. So if I need to charge my phone, but that's the input for for uh, the stuff. So let's see if we can do it right now. Oh yeah, it's not even charged. So it has uh, two different settings for that. Um, the cool thing too, look at this. It's, it's got a solar panel right on top. So it can actually charge this if you let it sit in the sun. The cool thing too is that it's got this built-in, uh, they call it reading lamp. So when you're reading something, you know, you don't want to have like that hard flashlight. It's just this little LED strip that it's enough to read. So I found that really, really cool. Uh, it also has an SOS on it as well. Um, and oh, here, here's, here's what I really love about it. No sun, no batteries, no nothing. Guess what? Going old school, baby. We're cranking this. How freak, I am so pumped. I love stuff like this, guys. So anyways. So I'm excited about that. I'm gonna get that going. See if, uh, is this for the batteries? Yeah, that's for the batteries. So that's the, uh, that's not the last resort, but that's the second to last resort is to have those batteries. It's got a built-in uh, battery, obviously, as you guys know, here it is. I gotta take the, oh, you know what? Yes! All right, so high, low, off. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. You guys actually get to see it. All right, check this out. Look at that. LED. Boom. That's bright, right? And then low. Boom. And then this SOS. Oh, my God. This might sound loud. Hold on. That is dope. I need help, son. Oh, that is so cool. All right, I am excited now, guys. So you can also, uh, how are you powering this? Right, I'm gonna actually, I'm actually gonna turn it off. I wonder if I can turn it off. No, you can't. So you either use the power from uh, the, the AAA batteries or from the built-in uh, lithium ion battery. So I'm gonna put it on battery there so we're not using too much of the juice. Uh, but this is, of Expo dry erase markers are $3.99 each. The ream of stick. Oh, that is cool. That's FM. AM? AM always has a weaker link. Shortwave? Is this shortwave? Is that where people talk to each other, like, on ham radios? All right, and then the weather band. Wind southwest at night. On Martha's Vineyard, partly sunny. Temperature 77. Wind southwest at 5. Once again, repeating the 6 p.m. weather for the Providence metropolitan area. It was partly sunny. The temperature was... I am a kid in a candy store with this stuff, guys. And this wasn't even that bad. I want to say this was like 20 bucks, maybe 30. I'll have to look. If anybody reminds me down below, I'll try to remember. Um, and then once I have everything that I need, I'm actually going to update uh, the Amazon links down below. So if you guys want to partake in the fun, uh, we can have some fun. I am so, guys, I've, here's the thing. Oh, and it comes with a compass. Look at that. What? I don't know if it's a really good compass or not. Um, yeah, that's north. Okay, it works. Um, there's silly things that I've always wanted, like something like this. And I don't know why I waited so long. Guys, if there's something that you want, do me a favor. Go get it. Do me a favor. Go get it. If you need somebody to give you permission to go get it, I will be that person for you. That way you don't you can feel less guilty. Uh, I don't know. I shouldn't. Guess what? Lupe said I could. It's on him. Go get it. Especially if it's something so. Let's get this out of the way. Especially if there was uh, something so small that's gonna bring you joy like that. Go do it. And it doesn't have to be 
an actual product, guys. It can be a service. You Like, how long has it been since you got a pedicure? Many. Go do it. My, my happiness level, since I just opened that up, guys, has gone absolutely through the roof. I can't wait to play with that filter later on. I can't wait to play with that radio. I'm gonna be in the basement playing with it going, oh my God, can I get, what's shortwave? I'm gonna be Googling shortwave probably for the next hour or so because I wanna learn what that is. I wanna learn more about weather bands and I wanna know how, uh, I'm gonna be testing the battery out on here to see how many times I could charge my phone, how long I can leave the, the lamp on before it dies. There's just a lot of cool things like that. Um, and I can check that off my list. Guys, I'm old. I, I can't believe I waited till now to buy something like that for 20, 30 bucks. It's just a no brainer. So I guess that's the point of this video is go get a double cheeseburger, guys. Go on Amazon, go on wh wherever your favorite store is. Go get it, just go get it. That's it, that, that's it, that's today's video. Whatever it is, do it, life is short. I'm actually mad at myself right now that I haven't bought that earlier. But we could check it off our little hiking, camping, homesteading, off-gridding, prepping list. I have this huge list. And a lot of the products actually hit different components of it. So we're really excited. All right, guys. These videos have gone left field on, at the end of them, haven't they? Uh, like, comment, subscribe. Uh, we're really close to... 5900 and then we're on a 6k i gotta think of a place that we can do a 6k live um i gotta think of a really good place 6k six 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 steaks six steaks no i'm not gonna eat six steaks six cervezas six it's gotta have a flow we'll work on it fam be well eat well Go buy it and take care of each other. Ciao.